Hey guys, Piff here and I got a crazy glitch that's going to allow you to buy the collector edition cars in GTA 5 online without the collector's edition. So you're going to be able to buy the hot knife, the chameleon, the carbon RS. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys do and if you are a new viewer, if you guys could smash that like button. This is a huge glitch. If we could try to aim for over a thousand likes, that would be much appreciated. If you are new, if you could subscribe for more daily GTA 5 content, I would appreciate that greatly. So basically all that you're going to want to do for the first step is to bring up your phone and go into the internet browser and then go to travel and transportation. Go down to legendary. Now you could do this for any car I'm pretty sure but if you want to do it the way that I'm doing it to follow the video and do it for the collector's edition just click the LG. And once you have clicked the LG, you guys will see that it's there and you just want to go and hit the home button. Now after you hit the home button you just want to put your top cursor over that top bar at the very top the search bar and hit A, B really quickly. Now if you do it correctly you'll have what it looks like on the screen right here. You'll have the L key in the background and then you guys will have you know the, the chat pad up and you're just going to want to back on the details and delete the number and go in and put 29 for the hot knife. The chameleon is 30 and we believe the carbon RS is 31 but I can verify that and let you guys know. And you just want to go in there and put that in. Now once you do that, it will bring up the hot knife, which was 29, guys. And once you have done that, you just want to repeat your steps. You're going to go up and click the home button. Now after you hit the home button, you're just going to hover over the top internet browser search again. And you're going to hit A, B once again. All you want to do at this point is just delete everything up to .NET with the forward slash. Delete everything in front of that. And then go put in purchase car. Once you have done that, you just want to click enter on purchase car. And what's going to happen is you guys will now see that the hot knife is sold to me. And at this point, you're good to go. All you have to do is you have to call your mechanic to deliver the vehicle to you. Now, so like the previous hot knife glitches, it's going to be invisible in your garage. So you're not going to be able to dupe it for anyone. And you're going to have to call your mechanic to have them deliver it to you. And that's the only way that you're going to be able to get it out of your garage. And in order to put it back into your garage, it's just going to be like the modded cars. You're just going to want to go in grab a car, bring it out of your garage, and drive it back into your garage. And then that's how you'll be able to get your hot knife back into your garage. But once again, in your garage, it's going to be invisible. All you want to do is just call your mechanic to have them deliver it to you. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I want to let you guys know that this is going to be hot patched uh, probably by tomorrow like they did with the money glitch. So if you want to get in on this, I would do this right away as soon as possible. Don't forget to drop that like and share it around with your friends because it's going to be patched by tomorrow. I think if you do the glitch and you have the cars in your garage, you're going to be good. There's going to be no way for them to actually take them away from you without a patch. But they're going to be able to hot fix this and we're not going to be able to buy them. So if you want to do it, I would recommend doing it right away. Do it today. And uh, yeah, share the video around. I just want to say thank you guys for watching. If you are a new viewer and if you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys could subscribe. And if we could all smash that like button, if we can aim for over a thousand likes, that would be much appreciated. I will also have a Google Plus down in the description if you guys want to go over there and follow me. And a Twitter, at Sir Piffington. That's with two N's. You guys should go follow me over there so you guys can get updates and get my videos right away. I just want to say thank you guys for watching and some more GTA 5 videos coming soon. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.